Let's just get Ribery! Ribery! Get in! Where's my glasses? Where's my glasses? Let me get Ribery. Let me get Ribery. Let me get Ribery. Grand National. Reeb! He joins! Thank you, boys! Thank you, boys! Boom! 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 There we go! What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel and today we are taking a look at Frank Ribery. So we did actually spin for Ribery as you saw at the start of the video and if you missed the pack opening you can check that out. But is Ribery any good, right? Let's get down to the nitty gritty itty little bitty titty, right? So Frank Ribery is down here as a 99 overall player when you get the booster with him. Now this isn't actually what his overall is going to be, it's going to be higher. We'll show you that towards the end. But the big decision you need to make with Ribery, lads, as you can see from the screen here, is where you're going to play him. Are you going to play him central, as a lot of people are in that little pocket, that whole player type uh, position, which is an attacking midfielder, touch and go, such as you see here. He's down at 102 overall. We'll show you the build in a second. Or are you going to play him out on the left or right wing, right where Corona is? There is kind of where I would play him, right? It depends on your play style. It depends on what you want to get out of him. Is Ribery insane? Does he have brilliant stats? Is he rapid quick? Yes, he is. But is he kind of a meta player? That remains to be seen. I think it depends on the build. The build for this player and for the new players is extremely important, right? You can see here with the tight dribbling, the tight possession, the pass and go, touch and go, whatever you want to talk about, very centralized direct play. Ribery will be good, but I think he really comes into his own out in this position, right? So we'll get to the builds in a second. I'll show you the builds in a second and I'll show you a couple of clips, some offline, some online. When you're testing the players offline, you can actually get a feel a little bit for the players, but to really know how these players like handle and how good they are, you do need to take them online and see how they handle, right? We live stream our games, we do play and test out live, like builds that people recommend, and I think that this build that we have here towards the end of the video at like the four and a half minute mark is probably the ultimate version. We're actually retest him and rebuild him within this video towards the end, right? But as I said, you do need to decide whether you want a central player or if you want him out wide. I think for his blister and pace and his player ID and his skills, you do need to have him in a position like this. This is against Legend AI where you're going to be cutting in and shooting, right? Depending on how you want to play, whether you want to pass or shoot from your wing option. But it's all about tight possession, tight control, and literally stop, start uh, sprinting and dribbling, right? So it's basically, you know, transitioning from sprinting to stop to sprinting again, a little trick uh, in and around the, the players as well, right? So this is the build that we've actually gone for for our attack and midfielder position. I don't really recommend this, lads, right? Even if you max out his low passing and you don't put the dribbling as high, right? 100 overall with the booster is a little bit excessive in my opinion. I don't think there's any real difference, personally speaking, from the players between, you know, making them like a 95 uh, in any stat to like 97, 98. Yes, when you go to 100, there can be a tiny bit of a difference, which we'll see in a clip here towards the end when we boost up the speed. But I think that the dribbling at 100, it, there isn't enough animations or unique unlocked animations that are going to kick in, right? This is where Ribery really excels, lads, right? This is the same match that we just showed a minute ago, but he's in a different position. He's going to swing the ball in, and we'll show you the build of him towards the end of this video in just about 30 seconds, right? But this is kind of what Ribery is all about, right? Getting these chances, a little double touch, brilliant feet, rapid animations going through the cycle, and then boom, lovely ball into the dome of Corona, and Corona always finishes his dinner, lads, salt and pepper notwithstanding, right? But look at the blister and pace of Ribery here, and this is a good test because you can actually see when you're playing offline how the game is going to ebb and flow you know without a connection right and how it's just going to play offline and i think that this rebury build is probably the best version of it this is the ultimate build that i found after playing with him we're going to reset him from a 98 overall we're going to get him in now one thing i will say is be careful when you're training up players lads don't make the mistake of mi mi missing and mixing up the max booster effect, right? Because what happens is, when you're actually training him in this form here, you won't be able to see the booster um, visibly toggled on and off, right? But on this screen, you will in the game plan. So when we boost him up here, we're going to stick to that 90 of every stat that we want, right? And we're going to boost up his dexterity quite a bit as well. You can pause the video here in about 10 seconds to get the build uh, when it's on screen. 
But we're just going to pop in a load into dexterity, a load into dribbling, and then we're going to just make him a little bit better at the passing and the finishing just to kind of round that off. But the stats that he has are going to be ridiculous. We're going to have all the key stats that you want from a cut-in winger and a speedster dribbler that are going to be 90 plus. Like 90 and above is insane. And the three key stats that we want, acceleration, balance, and dribbling, are going to be well over 95, which is brilliant, right? So for me, I think Ribery is a bit of a game changer. I don't know, would you recommend, you know, spending coins on him? Obviously, everyone has a different perspective of that. But there are players for GP. If you want to see a video on that of who compares to Ribery, let me know. We already have to do the wingers for all budgets, but let me know. But for me, yeah, I'm looking forward to playing with Ribery. Thanks to everyone that donated on the stream. And I hope you guys will subscribe and see some action with Ribery and Drogba in the next live stream. We'll be back Thursday. So, yeah. All right, lads. Peace.